How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Trucker Tim Trans Tech Vlog. So today I'm off work at Data Shredders and I'm doing a few bits at Trans Tech. Apparently there's some fans here waiting for me. Allegedly, here I am. Oh, I just stalled it. <laughs> we just stalled it. Oh yeah, by the way, the Cougar's back. We've got the Cougar back. So first truck I'm looking at, Stuart Harvey Transport's new DAF XG Plus. I've got a fan here, he's come down to pick the truck up. He's had all these side skirts put on at Transtech, catwalk, this A-frame to have a look inside. You can adjust these up and down up there, look. I'd love to have a night out in one of these just to see how comfy it is. Opted to not have the cameras. Uh, I don't think he likes them. No, I don't like them. But up here... Don't worry about shoes, Tim. Don't worry about shoes, just get in. Are you it's sure? Fine. Yeah, no, it's fine. It's got, uh, it'll be all cleaned up anyway, so oh, okay. don't worry about it. Yeah, so up here, just down there, just sticking out there, you can see that camera, it's like a dome. You can see all the way to the back and all the way around to the front here. I like that camera, that's about the only camera I like. Other than that, it should be mirrors. Still even got all this daft stuff in it. Brand spanking new. Got the Transtech badge here waiting to go on. Right, I think I'm going to do a little TikTok on this, and then we'll see what's next. Do like these side skirts though, I love all the lines on them. Very different. So here we have Stuart Harvey Transport's new DAF XF. XF? XF? XF. <laughs> well, it's quite, it's quite a XF. step up from the XF. XG Plus, yeah. So here we have Stuart Harvey Transport's new DAF XG Plus. Give us some tones then. <laughs> hey! We'll watch this one go. So that's my first job of the day done here at Transtech done a TikTok on that beast, but it's not finished yet. I need to catch up with it when it's painted to finish off the TikTok. See you later, mate. Get some toes, boy. <laughs> hey. What's next? So in the boot here of the Cougar, we've got a lazy spa here. So this is a little bit of an insider for you YouTube guys. There's a TikTok coming with this lazy spa. I've got it here today to plug it into a generator to see if the generator will run the bubbles. Just keep your eye on my TikTok. Apparently I've got a parcel. Oh, I got I got a parcel! Parcel! <laughs> Trucker Tim from Scania. Oh, it's Scania. Whoa, thank you. This is from Mark Cox, the regional general manager of Scania Truck East. I'm taking it outside, you're too noisy. Wheel nut caps? What? No way. Oh my god, it's like a full set. Actual full set. Scania, waistcoat, high vis. What are these? Oh my god. Scania boxers. The Scania t shirt. Oh my god. I, don't, I wasn't expecting all this. Oh, you know what this is? It's a Scania V8 keyring. I've actually got gifted one of these in my PO box, you remember? Another Scania top. V8 Scania t-shirt. I take it, that's a mug. Another mug, oh, they're three mugs. What's this? Ah, these. I needed some of these. I lost one when I picked the truck up. Oh, epic. I lost one of these when I picked the truck up, do you remember? It fell off. These must be like wheel trims or something. Get this open. Wow. I can't get over how much stuff he sent me here. Thanks so much. Let's have one of these mugs out of here. Thanks, Mark. How do you work this thing? Oh, Volvo, Mark. Where's the box? <laughs> Shut up. It's like them soda dispensers in the garage. Choco milk. Ooh. No, it's coffee, Tim. <laughs> Thank you, Richie. <laughs> you got the battery? Yeah, it doesn't last very long, though. Oh. Like literally two minutes. We've got something a little bit different to have a look at now. Are you ready for this? Ooh, check this out. It's an Oskosh. Let's have a look around this bad boy. So it's now time for me to do a TikTok on this one. The content is just flowing, flowing. <laughs> this bit here digs into the ground gives it a good anchor point. This is me next to a tyre. I'm six foot. It's got four drive axles. What a monster. Let's have a climb up here. Climb aboard. Whoa. These switches, oh my word. More levers here. Look at these pipes. 
wouldn't have a clue where to start operating this. I wonder what the visibility is like up there. I have to get in and check it out. Look at this massive winch on the front. King Kosh. We've got these steps out so we can get in easily. The little tour out of forklift matches, look. Track a tin sticker on it. Let me take my shoes off. Are you ready for this? <laughs> check this out in here. Let's move the seat forward like that. And let's climb in to this bad boy. Oh, I can't get in. Tight squeeze. Look at these seats. Oh, here he is. Ant. How long have you been standing there? Oh, all right, good. Mint in there, isn't it? It is mint in here, yeah. You done all the speakers, didn't you? Mm hmm. You did. Look, in here we've got two subwoofers, what, like a 12 inch? Yeah. Yeah, look, I'm getting to know. No speakers across here. All Hertz, of course. We only deal with Hertz, don't we, Ant? The best, Only the best. Two amps here, look. Drinks holders, are these drinks holders or a port? No. No, they're just drinks holders. Oh, here's the head unit. Transtech interiors. I love the ultra modern double din head unit. And then all the heating controls are like this, all old school. What's all this here? Oh, this is the different thing for the uh, traction and stuff, look. Mud, sand and snow, cross country, highway, max speed 45. Emergency, max speed five miles an hour. I wouldn't know where to start driving this. Look at these buttons. Engine, brake. What, look at all the buttons. <laughs> what a beast. Look at the headlining. We've got all little lights in here as well. And here on the middle, we've got a lovely little spot here that's been made, especially for the control box for the winch and the arm and everything else. So this is the point of view from the driver's seat. <laughs> Check the blind spots out. Times! Yes! I think there's literally more buttons in here than an aeroplane. So here we have Crouch Recovery's monster of a recovery truck. So there we go, I've just done a TikTok on that great big monster. Right, what's next? Right then, let's see if this lazy spa can be run off a generator. Oh, wrong one. You've seen this split boot, look, on the Cougar. It's smart, isn't it? And then this one, full boot. Where's the pump? We don't need the whole lot, do we? Come on, spark. Right. Where are we? Here she be, here she be. Ooh. Here we go. Do you think a generator will run a lazy spa? I hope so, because it's a video coming up on my TikTok. <laughs> Make sure you go follow me on TikTok now, guys, so you don't miss it. Where's the Jenny? Oh, it's behind all this Kelsa stuff here. It's a nice ball bar chilling here under blankets. What are these? Some sort of scan your four series lights, by looks of it. Tones. Look at them. Plug this in here. Like this. And then plug the spar into that. Right, how do you work this head? Here we go, you can come and be my cameraman. What have we got there for lunch, look? Spaghetti and meatballs. Oh, you can do it, Richie. Go on. Chips. Do you think it's gonna run it? Do I think it's gonna run it? There's an upcoming TikTok that involves that. In your truck? In my truck, yeah. Bang! Oh, it's on, look! Lit up! You can run a lazy spa off a generator. He works. So I need to borrow that. Oh yes. That's going to be me soon. <laughs> Whoa, hang on. What's going on here? The Cougar's falling apart. Right, so my next job is to take this Mercedes here. Never driven one of these before. We've got to take this and go and pick up two. Oh God. Might have to move the seat back a bit. We've got to take two headboards, the ones that go on the front of trucks at the top, you know, light board, headboard thingy bobs. Uh, there's not one here I can show you. But yeah, I've got to take two of them from John Thomas's, where my Scania is, take them from there across to Global Signs to get it all stickered up. So let's crack on. See you later, Cougar. Let's go. Tell you what, I'm having another awesome day at Transtech. I mean, I'm having a good time. I'm getting all the content for you guys. But yeah, it's just awesome. Okay, so this is where the headboards are. Right, okay, <laughs> so there's been a big change of plan. I turned up here to get the headboards and they said, oh, 
don't you want to strip your Scania? I was like, yeah, we'll do the headboards tomorrow. So I've just stripped the Scania down. Well, made a start anyway. If you want to watch that video, click here and we'll continue this vlog tomorrow because I'm off work again tomorrow, doing a bit more for Transtech. So we we'll continue the vlog tomorrow. I'll speak to you all tomorrow, guys. So you rejoin me back at Transtech. It's day two, continuing on the vlog. So I've just arrived, as you can see, there's a nice black Scania there. But yeah, things have changed now. The two headboard, I'm rolling. I didn't put my handbrake on. Um, yeah, things have changed. The two headboards, we're gonna do that later on today. But first thing, we've got to take a couple of Scanias over to Wisbridge. So we'll get some point of view in a Scania. What? So let's crack on. So here we go. This is our first job. We've got to take this little Scania, brand spanking new, with the air deflector kit on the back like this over to Wisbridge and swap it for another one. Look at this, I've never driven one of these little no cabs before. Yeah, P500. Get a little bit of point of view in this bad boy. Look, it's even got all the protective stuff on the seat still. The bed's all wrapped up. Let's climb in. This will be the first time I've driven a brand new Scania on the road. I've driven a brand new Volvo, but not a brand new Scania. All right, let's get this thing started. Oh, yes. How many miles has it done? 159 miles. That's all it's done. Get it in reverse. Oh, just adjust the mirrors. So they're right for me. I'm driving a brand new truck. Oh God, don't hit anything, Tim. Ooh. It says we've got 8% fuel left, 70 miles. That should be enough for what we want. Look at me driving a little P P500. Oh, let's have that. Let's go. Straight out. Yes! I've got all this stuff in here. Oh, all that is. Can't believe I'm driving a brand new Scania on the vlog. <laughs> it drives nice. It does drive nice. I need to clean that window screen a little bit. How do we do that on this? Oh no, that's the lights. I've just flashed somebody. <laughs> Push the button in, here we go. Give that a little clean. I'll tell you what, these Scanias, they do drive nice. Get us a cut the tones! <laughs> oh, they're rubbish. Oh, I'd love a brand new truck. Just drives so nice, and the brakes as well. Just everything. Oh, hello, what we got here? Look at that. Nice. Oh, collision warning. I weren't gonna have a collision, was I? I didn't think I was. It's a quick old thing. I haven't driven a brand new truck for about nine, 10 years. And when you do, everything just feels new. Well, I suppose it's because it is Tim. Okay, so I've arrived where I need to be. He's just bringing the other one out now. This one is blue. And I'm gonna put this one where that one was. And then we'll get cracking back to Transtech with this one. Yes, this is fun. <laughs> Truck of Tim in a brand new Scania P series. That's done 167 miles now. Oh, but this, these little P series are quite cool. Easy to get in and out of and everything. Got 6% diesel now. Running low. Here comes the other one. Oh, this one's nice in blue. Oh, okay, here's the next one. Better get this tray plate in the front. Nice. Make sure that's not going to come off. The last thing we want is that coming off up the road. It's another P500. Loving the blue. Let's hop in. Now this one inside has got more stuff in it. That's all wrapped up. I don't know what this is. This is the wind deflectors. Yeah, these are the deflectors and stuff here. Look, that's what it was in the other one. Spark her up. How many miles has this one done? 189. This one's done. Oh. This one's done a few more miles. Can you hear that? Listen. <laughs> That's the auxiliary brake. <laughs> I've got this cable tie here. Can you see that? Keep digging in my leg. Listen to it. Look at you. Listen. Can you hear that? Let's clean this window. Ooh. One of Richard Cobbley's here, look. They've got some nice motors. 
Does he do tangs? <laughs> Me and my little P500. <laughs> Here comes Cobbly. <laughs> We're back. All right, let's see what's happening next. Okay, so next job is in the Transtech van again. We're going to drop these off and then pick the headboards up. Get in here. It's not got aircon, has it? I can't believe this van hasn't got aircon. Oh, God. Ugh. Better get the windows down then. That was in gear. That was in gear. We nearly went through the fence. <laughs> um, let's start that again. Let's make sure it's out of gear. Yeah, it's out of gear. Oh my God. I don't think anybody see. Let's get cracking and drop these. <laughs> God, hay fever. Let's get cracking, get these bits dropped off and then go and get the headboards. Let's go. Right, so we landed to drop these bits off. I'm going to unload them now and then we'll get across and pick up the headboards and we'll be able to look at the Scania again. Yes. I've also spotted in here some Trucker Tim stickers. Look, what are they doing in here? That's done that job. Oh, what job getting in and out of this fan? Now, let's go and pick up the headboards and have a little look at my Scania. We're back again. Dee -dee -dee -dee. I can just see the back of it there. There she is. Look at her now. There's not much on her. Oh no. Oh dear. There she is. Ooh, what's this pulling in here? This looks nice. She's looking a bit rough. Let's just seeing better days. But if you look in there, it's quite a bit of rust. Yeah, but I definitely, definitely had fun stripping this down yesterday. Need a new shot to look. She'll be alright. She'll be alright. We'll get it. Get it shot blasted and what have you. Yep, he follows me. There we go, that's the headboards loaded up. They just need to be put together when we get back. They're looking good. And that trucking sounds is whittling for his, so we better get it back to him. Right. <laughs> I don't know why I have such a job getting in and out of this van. Transtech errands. Later on, they've got a Scania in there that they're just building back up. We've got to go and collect that and take it back to Transtech. We've got one from Transtech to come over here and then collect that take it back to Transtech. So it'll be a bit more point of view later on in the old vlog. We are back. We've just followed Kingsley Auto Electrical in. Both turned up at once. Right, I've got your headboard. Are you ready for it? Yeah. Come on, let's get it on. <laughs> Just a tour out of Yaris boot lid there. Got to turn that down, sorry, for uh, copyright. Yeah, probably would actually. There we go. And then a bit of perspex goes in there, doesn't it? Yeah, just watch out for them screw holes. Yeah, well, I've got, Make it's sure got, it's shorter than screw holes. Well, it's going to have to be anyway, it's going to have to be cut here. I'll, I'll cut it. Will Yeah. Got it. Right. What do I use to cut it? <laughs> Look at this little tipper. Ant's put these work lights on. Down the back, he's put these lights on here. Mitchell and Mem on the roof. And we're just fixing up the headboard now, ready to go on. We put this light bar on here. That's where you cut the end off. Ah, uh, to cover the end up, yeah. Here we go. Don't work, mate. There we go. And offer it up. Does it line up? No. Oh. Of course it, lines of course it lines up. Had a Mitchell and Men central. Ish. Yeah, they look good. Look good. Huh? There's some four series seats here. I've got my eye on them. A bit dusty, but we could put our name on them, couldn't we? Trucker Tim. Where are you? Oh, here it is. Thanks, sir. We just lobbed them in there okay. with the old air horns. More, uh, more merchandise. <gasps> Language. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Where have I been at school? Get us some tones. Is this all the teacup? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get that? Exactly. <laughs> you need a hard hat on round here, Ant. I'll just take <laughs> <laughs> I know what Scandia switches look like. Sunroof. Ooh. Oh no, look. Sunroof. Beep, 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 beep. There's a seat on there. Beep. Oh. What do you want? That headboard. Beep, beep, beep. Beep. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. 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 Julie's beep. Jeep. Whenever you're in a video, Ant, it, <laughs> it, it takes me a lot more time to edit. <laughs> you have a lot of trust in my editing. Oh, God. <laughs> beep, beep. Are we all right now? Can I let go? It's okay. I've let go. This trailer here, full of wood, we're gonna, they're gonna, well, I say we, they're gonna section this off and make two separate rooms here. And that's happening this afternoon, isn't it? Apparently. Time is getting on though. One for woodwork, One for woodwork. Okay. That'll be your bit, won't it? Yeah. Woodwork bit. Yeah. And then the other one's gonna be hydro dipping. So we're gonna start doing hydro dipping. Then I'm gonna see what stuff I can hydro dip. Everything is gonna get hydro dipped. <laughs> You can even hydro dip a Michelin man. End bits? No, because we've got a... Oh, I don't know, do I? Oh, hello, what's going on here? We can put some well, supports support on it. On the back. I'm going to do a 5,000 steps today. Oh, you got a step counter? Just on my phone, yeah, so have you. What? It's Ooh. truck max. Oh, truck max are here. Oh, truck max. Are you qualified to use this? Yeah. Right, can we turn that music down? There's a knob. <laughs> There's a knob. Yeah, That'll do. Right, wee. How do we bend? You're about to learn as fast as I'm going to. Okay, cool. This is the bender. Close. Give it some. Oh, oh, oh. 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 too much. Look at all these nut and bolts, here. Everyone you could imagine there. Oh, he's off. Give us some tones. Is that that fruit up stuff? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> fruit up premium. Of course it's gonna fit. Oh no, no if Miles Something went wrong here. <laughs> Other way round. Flick it round. <laughs> oh, that's better. We just need a little bit more angle on that upper up that top end. On this one? Yeah. Try that's that one. It's gonna take a long time, isn't it? No. Yeah, we just need a bit more angle on that top one. Okay, so I'm back where I was earlier. Got the Transtech van here. Just had a lift over to pick this lorry up. Oh, oh. look at that. Climb aboard. And I've got a follower with me, look. I've got Harley with me. He's coming for a ride. Sean at Transtech's family friends. He's a big follower, so he's coming for a ride in the truck and he's going to be my cameraman. Yeah, mate, yeah, you have to plug. Um, let me show you how that works. I know, it's a bit of a pain. Stick that one in there. Yeah. That's it. And then that one in there like normal. There we go, mate. Thank you. Oh, let's get it started up. So this is the third brand new lorry I've drove today. So, are you any good with GoPros, Harley? Don't know. <laughs> First time using a GoPro. Let's just live level out the suspension. We grab that. So, have a go. So you can see, whatever's on that screen there is what will be on the YouTube video. Okay. Sean's off. See you later, Sean. Right, I better get my belt on. Let's go trucking. So we get some tones. Mhm. Mm I don't think there's any air horns on this though. I've got a fan here. So this is your first time in a truck car, is it? Yeah. Wow. What do you think to it? Yeah. High up, isn't it? Yeah. Do you feel king of the road? Yeah. You're seeing everybody's gardens. You can be nosy. Fields. Hey. There's fields All the fields, everywhere. yeah. We might see a combine in a minute. Yeah. Tell you what, let's give it some tones. <laughs> so yeah, this lorry, has only done 20 miles. Mad. Oh, there's a lorry. Get that one. Get some tones. Oh, I love the turbo whistle on these. What the hell? Oh, it's because I went over the white lines. God, it's got all the gadgets. Look at that. Check that out. Loads of haystacks. Yeah, haystacks. So how is it being truck tip? 
<laughs> How is it being Trevor Tim's cameraman? Good. Do you like that? That could be your new job if you like. Mm -hmm. Come around and follow me with a camera all day. I need a cameraman. I'll tell you what, with these bags on these seats, I'm sliding around a lot, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Just hard to keep in the seat with these on. Can you get it in? Yeah, please. Thank you. Convoy Narvista. Tractor Tang. Do you do tangs? <laughs> Me and my sister and I do it all the time. Do they? Yes! <laughs> We were doing it yesterday. You give it a tang in front of the camera so you can see your hand. Tang. Yeah, boy! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh, they got a pump. You're right there. Give us some tires! <laughs> I don't like these tires much. I just want proper air horns. Do you like my musical air horns? Yeah. They're good, aren't they? Yeah. Combine tang! I haven't done that before. You give him one. Get, get Combine tang! The... Yes! We're off. There's a truck. There is a truck coming. Make sure you tang him. Okay. There's two. There's two. Bell the Welsh tang, man tang, and Renault tang. <laughs> tang. Not interested. <laughs> they weren't interested, were they, Harley? No. Flash out, Mr. Jack Richards. We are back at. Tra oh, he said thanks for his lights, you see? Yeah. <laughs> you enjoyed that, didn't you? I think you wanted yeah. to carry on, really. I want to carry on to Yarmouth. Yarmouth? Yeah. We're back at Transtech HQ. Where's the handbrake gone? This one's got a different handbrake to the P series. Hello. Did you enjoy that? Give yeah. me a thumbs up if you did. And a tang as well. Yes. I gave you some stickers as well, didn't I? Look. Yeah. Here we go. A couple of trucker tin stickers for you there, mate. I'll get your hat as well out of the car. Give this one to Anne. Because Ant's got to do some stuff on this one. Yeah, we'll show you this one next. You can get it on the camera. You haven't seen it yet, have you? That one. Look at this orange one. No, look. Oh, the orange look one. Look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> do I have a look around that with me? Yeah. Yeah? Look at that bad boy. Look oh at the driver's god, it's seat. It's massive. It looks like a lifeboat thing. It does look like a lifeboat. It's a like a it's more like a life truck. Whoa. <laughs> Are you alright there? Yeah. I'll help you out. Getting out of these. Yeah. Because I don't suppose you got out one of these before. You have to come spin round. That's it. Backwards. Hang on. That's it. Make sure you've got a good step. Oh, you're good at that. I think you've been in a truck before. I don't know. I, I think you I might have. I've sat in one. Oh, you've sat in one. Well, look at that hat. Thank you. Thank you. Right, come round here with me. Let's go and get your high vis first. Oh, I recognise this lorry from earlier. It's in my car here, mate. I've got a box of hats ready for a merch store but you can have one of them put it on top of trend leave them both on i like that that's cool <laughs> yes what a beast i've stole harley's hat look yeah <laughs> can't have music on mate sorry when i'm filming does it distract you no it doesn't distract me copyright <laughs> oh he's having them so shot blasted by oh, right. aaron ah. my yeah. scan is first so we've got the headboard on. So my next job, and my final job of the day, is to take this one to go and be painted. So back down to where my Scania is, get this one painted up. Drop this one off and bring another one back. Got the tray plate on the fifth wheel. I love that front splitter. So yeah, this will be my first ride out in one of the new Volvos. So we're on board. This is the first time I've driven one of these. Right. Oh, it's just got air on the front. If it is, this will be the first time me driving a truck with air on the front. Let me have a look at this controller. I don't know. Yeah, it has. I think... Oh! I've just sold something on my merch store. Yeah, I think it has got air on the front. So this will all be new. This is all new. We need to go get some diesel because it says we've got zero miles to empty and we don't want to run out. We haven't got to go far, but the truck's obviously got to come back as well. So I've got the Transtech card for diesel and we're going to uh, put some diesel in it KGB's letting me out thank you KGB we'll give him a flash of the old indicators I can't believe how many different trucks I've driven today <laughs> it's mad really nice truck I love this, all this infotainment screen these seats are blowing air. Oh my God, this truck is 
fully specced. Here we go. Can you hear that? That's blowing cold air through the seat. Oh, wow. Talk about luxury. Motorbike tang. Prepare for a break. Drive time has exceeded four hours, 15 minutes. This is nice though, this is. We like this. Parking climate. Oh, it's got a night cooler. It's got a night cooler. This truck has actually got everything. I don't even know what size engine this one is. What engine has this got? Let's turn them seats off, they're a bit worry. In we go. Oh, look at that burnt out car on there. God. What's all the beeping? I haven't done four hours, 15 minutes driving. Stupid thing. Let's go put some diesel in. I love that splitter and those lights. So I just took my card in. I need this key here to get in to where the diesel cap is. There we go. Now I need the keys. Look at all this lot. Oh my word. Here we go. Let's put some diesel in her. What an awesome day I've had. Well, it's a couple of days. This vlog is over two days. I hope you guys have enjoyed it too. If you have, let me know in the comments. And also give the video a thumbs up. Boss, I stopped that dead on 60. Look at that, 60 quid. Shut that, then lock it again. Very good. So we're all paid up. I've got my keys and my cable ties. Let's get this one over to John Thomas's for paint. It's gonna be lovely when it's painted. We'll have to see if we can catch up with this once it's all painted. So the fuel light's still on. <laughs> I put 60 quid in and the fuel light is still on. I'm gonna crack on over there. Get this one dropped off. Okay, so right now guys, I'm on a very, very bumpy bit of road. And oh my God, this air suspension on the front is perfect. It handles the bump so much better. It's amazing. Wow. Here we go. Straight in, we'll see my truck again. All right, let's see where they want this one. Probably straight inside. And reversing straight into the shed. And look what's beside me. <laughs> Are we good? Here we go, we're in. And that one there is the one we've got to take back to Transtech. Let's take this one back then. Busy, busy day. Absolutely love this candy blue. Let's check that out. That one's in, ready for paint next. There's mine. Well, that's nowhere near ready for paint, let's be honest. I think I've got to raise this up at the front. That looks quite low at the front. There we go. I don't feel like I want to stand on these nice steps. I suppose I've got to to get in. This tray plate in the window. We're ready to roll. So this one's on air on the front as well. I think this truck's got tones. There's a little button here with a horn on it. Can you see that? That indicates to me that this truck might have tones. Let's go nice and steady. It's just been resprayed in white with all those candy blue accents. And I'm the first one to drive it on the road. So it's a little bit nerve wracking. <laughs> Let's give it a tang and a tone. It has got tones on the top. They're sort of linked in. Let's turn the switch off. Yeah, switch on. Love it. How lucky am I to drive all these trucks today? And now we're driving this, an older truck, but basically fully resprayed. It's awesome. I've had the time of my life today. I'm just trying to keep away from them trees without ramming anyone else off the road. Last thing I'll do is run the wing mirror through a tree. All right, let's go. Look at that candy shining. It is nice. What a privilege though, to be the first person to drive this after it's sprayed on the road. Whoa, it's quick. Jesus, it is quick. 
Whee! Oh, this air suspension is so good. All right, we're back at Transtech. A short little drive there. And it takes about five minutes to get from there to here. Right. See where they want this one put in then. Don't turn it off, he said, because there's a problem with the batteries. So I remember that. I really don't feel like I should be standing on these steps. Ah, oh, it's a 520 V8. Didn't know they'd done a 520 V8. There we go. Richie's parking that up there. Very cool, very nice. We'll get this off. Have you got one? Give us some times. <laughs> <gasps> Hello. 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 That was much more polite. Turn that rubbish down. So yeah, work is just about to start to do the two sectioned rooms. One for Ant and all his trucking sound stuff. And um, this one's going to be for hydro dipping. Transtech are going to start doing hydro dipping. That's going to be awesome to show you guys. So this is all the wood here on this trailer, ready to build these rooms. So here we have just a full pallet of Kelsa. Mental. So there we go guys, that's the end of this Transtech vlog. Really hope you enjoyed it. Got a lot of content over these two days. Like I say, I hope you enjoyed it guys. If you did, please hit the subscribe button, give this video a like and leave a comment as well because I read all your comments and I give you all the little heart. But yeah, we'll definitely do plenty more of these down at Transtech and I'll speak to you on the next video, whatever that may be. Speak to you later guys, thanks for watching. Cheers!